So hey there. Um, so I was just kind of feeling like going through, I was going through some boxes in my closet and I came across this wonderful book, Goosebumps Vampire Breath. And I know that there's a really good vlog out there, which I will link to right here or maybe over here, depending. Um, but um, I, I know it's like really amusing and you should definitely go check them out. But um, I think I'll just kind of describe it in a similar like a Naramon like fashion. Here goes nothing. I have, a, I have a problem with the first line. It says that blah, 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 you don't know the werewolf is there until you feel his hot sour breath on the back of your neck. How can breath, how can you feel sour breath? So basically there are these two children. Their names are stupid. Their names are Kara and Freddy. And basically they're tough. They've been friends since the fourth grade. And they doodle around and they're babysitting for some bizarre reason. And they're telling that babies, the kid that they're babysitting that werewolves exist. And they're telling this thoroughly non-interesting story. And it's supposed to be scaring the child. And then the parents come home and they give them money because that's what you do when you hire someone to watch your child and they scare them to death. You give them money, of course. Then they play air hockey for a while, which is thoroughly uninteresting, and they do this thing where they wrestle and have karate kicks, which is, of course, that's what you do with your best friend. You karate kick them. Anyway, they run into a cabinet. It falls over, crash, everything breaks, and surprise, surprise, there is a secret tunnel behind it. They, it, it's like they find the passageway, right? And it has like a door on it, and they knock on the door and are like, anybody there before they open it. If you're in your basement, and there's a, a, a thing, do you, do, you, do you ask if there's someone there? Do you want someone to be in your basement? Would that be incredibly creepy? This does not make sense. There's a cabinet in front of it. I, I don't understand why you would assume that... <laughs> hmm. It moved slowly. It was heavy and the rusted hinges made an eerie squeak, squeak. I'm just going to read you some various fantastic lines that come out of this chapter. Just these few chapters, just so you understand the wonderful writing that that this author <laughs> uses. Kara is tough. That's why she's my best friend. We're both tough. When the tough, when going gets tough, we never crumble. Want to know how tough we are? We like it when our teacher squeaks the chalk against the chalkboard. That's tough. So this book is obviously amazing, but I actually have homework to do and it's Mother's Day tomorrow, so I should probably like make my mother a Mother's Day card or something. But um, yeah, that's just the first few chapters of this wonderfully glorious novel. So glad I decided to reread it. So this book is obviously amazing, but I actually have homework to do and it's Mother's Day tomorrow, so I should probably like make my mother a Mother's Day card or something. But um, yeah, that's just the first few chapters of this wonderfully glorious novel. So glad I decided to reread it. <laughs>